Okay, let's go. Hi y'all, I'm Redheaded Neighbor. Welcome today to the channel, to our little spot here on the interwebs where we listen to all kinds of good music. Um, so today, Rush Wednesday. I love Rush Wednesday. This, all of the, the Rush songs that I'm doing are ones that have been suggested by all y'all because um, it's interesting to me to have y'all lead me along this. Uh, there are a lot of artists in my own personal time that, you know, I went down the rabbit trail in, in my own way, and, and it's good, but to have a fan, like hardcore fans, and sometimes y'all have very personal connections with the songs. I know I do. Some of their songs are very extremely personal I feel like they have resonated with me so much um, and this one is for one of the the fellow uh, Rush fans this one is a very personal and has a deep connection and you know what to, to just to know that I, I don't know it makes listening even more interesting and that's one of the reasons why I love hearing you guys talk about them. So many of you have shared your rush stories with me, and I appreciate that. And um, I could go off on a on a side note, on a little side tangent. <laughs> Y'all may not want to hear it, but I get so tired of hearing people talk about how men are emotionally disconnected, and you know how they are uncaring and they don't feel anything. That is not true, and it just drives me crazy when people say things like that because Rush fans alone, actually every fan of any band has like this emotional connection, and when they tell me about it, and they tell me about the things they feel and they think connected with these songs, it, I, anytime I, I see people talking like that, I just want to like smack them. Enough of that tangent. <laughs> Let's hear open secrets. So I wasn't really, I wasn't sent a particular video. So I chose the lyric video because uh, I, I, I think I would like that. stop this song right here that was a line that uh that i was just told about and yeah it hits hard <laughs> okay
This one's going to be tough. Okay? So y'all just bear with me. I think that is such an important thing right there. Time will do its healing. You've got to let it go. Because all that stuff, all that stuff that has been put into us, either by other people or society or uh, circumstances of life, things that you have no control over, losses, um, burdens, things like that, um, Sheesh. Yeah. <laughs> we'll never let us grow. Time will do it healing. You've got to let it go. Let it go. Okay, so there is a, a percussion sound. Is <laughs> Y'all, please don't come at me. This is a serious question. I know that sometimes um, synthesizers can add in little sounds. But I would assume that Neil does not do that. But there's like a certain percussion sound. It sounds almost wooden or... Like a diff like a different kind of like a hand drum or something. Is that what I'm hearing? Right there. Right there. Do you hear that? I am no absolution in my rational point of view. Maybe some things are instinctive. There's one thing you could do You could try to understand me I could try to understand you You could try to understand me I could try to understand you Yes. I'm assuming Neil wrote this. I could try to understand you
offline. <laughs> I thought that was fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. To be honest, um, I didn't find the musical part of it something to brag about. Not that it wasn't great because it's Rush. <clears throat> but to me, the focus, the whole focus of that song was the lyrics. And the lyrics were very clear and feel like that was the most important part of this um musically yeah there was there were some interesting things in there but overall for me the takeaway of <laughs> get yourself healed because honestly like we all need it like that's <clears throat> I, I'm not really good like I've talked about this a lot on my channel I'm not really good at identifying and expressing how I feel a lot of times for multiple reasons. I'm working on it. I'm getting better. But it's not an easy thing to do. But songs like this, I feel like when they can put it into words for people like me and maybe for people like you, I mean, it's a, a blessing. It's honestly a blessing. It's huge. It's a big deal. And feel like once you're able to start identifying you can talk about it and then you can eventually get healed from it or at least get into a better place and be patient with yourself um some of you know some of you don't uh in the last few years i've had a lot of tragedy in my own life and grief and figuring out how to deal with that uh it's been a day by day thing and um yeah i'll just leave it at that so thank you very much for being here for helping me out on this journey thank you for the channel support and i don't mean just financially um obviously yeah that's thank you <laughs> like i'm not gonna lie that's helpful but on top of that just engaging with the channel like like y'all do and like comment subscribe i know that when youtubers say all that stuff it's like yeah 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 but it really is a, a really big way to support the channel it's very helpful it really is and for me with rush and a couple of the other uh, artists on this channel but with rush this it feels like a personal growth as well as just growing my music repertoire if that makes sense because i love to have fun and just enjoy music that's like one of my favorite things in the world to do but sometimes some of these songs hit kind of different and whew. so thank you 